You know, when 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 the pandemic hit, um, it was the same for for all of us. We we didn't know uh, what to expect. Uh, we didn't know what would happen next, and we we just felt, you know, at our core that something wasn't right, and the world felt upside down. And you know, our first response is is to react, and and when you do that, you're going to be pretty pretty empty emotionally. And uh, I, I write a blog called Sabbath Moment, and I do it literally, quite literally, to stay sane, uh, because it is in our DNA, every one of us. It's in our DNA to be replenished. It's in our DNA to be refueled. It's in our DNA to to be grounded, to be at home in our own skin. And when the world is crazy, it it feels like the antithesis of that, because because we've forgotten. And this is why I decided to write the book. We have forgotten what it's like to stay grounded, you know, to be at home with, with this this self, even in the craziness. And. My congregation, because we couldn't travel during that year, so my congregation that year, as I walked every morning on my island, my congregation was a was a group of sheep, and uh, I loved to stop by and try out my homilies. They, they were kind to me as long as I kept the homilies short. But literally, my my the permission for me just to speak out loud was the permission, and and I you know, you'll you'll see this a lot in the book was the permission to celebrate the sacrament of the present moment, even in the craziness.